Welcome back to part 17, I think, of Higurashi When They Cry. When we left off, um, we just won. Yeah, and we were awesome. And I accidentally clicked one more time, so... I'll just play this line again. I think I learned how to use my head a while ago. That's how I've been talking at all. I still see you in the same terrible light as always. I mean, you didn't. <laughs> After holding up the teddy bear like it was a championship trophy, I handed it to Rena. Sora. Oh, look at her face. Koitsa, ore kara. Yeah, minna kara da na. Itsu mo umai bento, arigato na. Oh, Rena, thinking she was never actually going to get it, was momentarily speechless. Well, technically, he was one who won it, so he can give it away to me. Yeah, exactly. So now it's mine to give to you. <laughs> yeah, I pushed the stuffed animal towards her again. This time she embraced and accepted it. すげえ感謝してるんだぜ。ありがとな。はあ。ケイチ君。ありがとう。いやいや。ロナドウィズミー。ヘイノ。オッケー。ワンスンティパッド。オッケー。ナミオントルミーフィーデイズレイターバット
<laughs> Before losing sight of Mion, I grabbed the back of Rena's collar. I didn't feel ashamed at all. Rena was ashamed enough for the both of us. I grabbed onto Rena's hand and dashed after Mion and the others. I hadn't realized Rana's hand was so de delicate. Maybe she needed a bit more exercise and nutrition. <laughs> that wasn't what I meant. Not at all. My ears burned. And haven't you, like, pulled her by the hand a few times now? I tried to keep calm. I repeated a phrase. Keep the Kevin Katie, my bra, in my mind, but it didn't look like I would be able to any time soon. I really didn't want Serena to see my face back then, so I pushed onwards, dragging her along without looking back even once. There was already a huge group of people gathered at the altar in front of the shrine. The fire at the altar made it as bright as midday and just as hot. There was a pile of futons watered with sanctified rope in front of the altar. Come to think of it, they did say it was a festival where they did something with the cotton and futons. Satoko waved her hand from the front row, oh, smart, smart. making our way through the mass of people, we reached the spot they'd saved. <laughs> uh, I think it was fairly obvious. Instead of replying, Mion gave us a perverse grin. Rena turned bright red, puffs of steam shooting out of her. I heard something slice through the air and turned around to see Mion on the ground with a welt on her face. Mion, you can't even tell. That's pretty bad. Rena, <laughs> That's gonna earn you a punch. Oh, okay. I was expecting her embarrassment to cause her to, like, go, I'm not embarrassed, kind of thing. Anyway, thump. The thunderous beat of the drum echoed, silencing the crowd. <laughs> it was a solemn ritual. Rika-chan and Rika-chan entered, dressed as a shrine maiden, followed by members of a municipal camp committee. The elders all looked at Rika-chan and cla clasped their hands in praise. The only thing allowed to disturb the profound silence was the flash from tomitaka sans camera. If you're talking about silence, then why are you talking about the flash? Surely the shutter sound, right? Like a Aren't you supposed to be silent? It was an awkward shape for a piece of farm equipment. Not uncommon common for something used in rituals. 
After reciting a Shinto prayer, Rika-chan approached the pile of futons gathered at the altar. Wait, her and futons, they totally go together. Yeah, how? What? Oh well. Okay, she swung the hose skillfully, plowing it into the futons. Each and every little movement of this performance probably had to be done in a certain way. I guess if they made with caution. Yeah, that's a farming thing. Plant. Yeah. I can words good. Without a doubt, this was a ritual. ゲイちゃんの布団叩きって表現もまあ外れじゃないかねミキちゃんの <laughs> face was already dripping with sweat that hoe was probably really heavy she staggered side to side with the momentum of each swing Satoko looked on silently lending her support Shinpaika? リカは毎日毎日お餅つきの木で練習してましたですのきっとやりきるでございますわ。Satoko's hands were sweaty, and whenever Rika-chan started to sway a little, she held her breath. ミオンとかは巫女役、リコをしなかったのかよ。ミオン a maiden? <laughs> what nonsense is that? リカちゃんにあの重さは気の毒だよ。そりゃ頼まれりゃやるけどねまあ誰にでも務まるものでもないしそうだよなミコは清らかじゃないとダメだもんなおーまあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ
opening is really showed me. I touched the cotton over myself three times. Thank you, Oyashiro Sama. Thank you, Oyashiro Sama. Oyashiro Sama. Together, Render and I set our pieces of cotton afloat on the surface of the water. The flowers of cotton blooming in the water had sucked out all the bad illnesses from Hinema's hour and drifted off, disappearing into the distance. Poor downstream towns who get cursed by Hinema's hour residents. Uh, it was wonderful, like those floating lantern festivals I'd seen on TV. The best part, though, was feeling like this rite of passage had made me a true resident of Hinamazawa. Hajimewa. Yeah. ちょっとした不安だった。誰かを傷つけたいなんて考えもしなかった。それでも不安は孤独を生んで疑念へと変わり、やがて黒い殺意が心を闇に閉ざしていった。戻らない日常。少年は足を踏み出す。その先が奈
the at incident of a dam construction site. The fighting over it and the other conflicts. That terrible incident that they pretended they didn't even know about whenever I brought it up. Even though it was in the past, as someone living in Hinamazawa, it wasn't wrong to want to know about both the good and bad that had happened to you. それを知ることで君が納得するなら、僕の知っている範囲で何でも教えるよ。トメタケさんの笑みが私に一番嬉しかったのは、私は何を聞いたのか、私は何を聞いたのか、私は何を聞いたのか、私は何を聞いたのか、私は何を聞いたのか、私は何を聞いたのか、私は何を聞いたのか、私は何を聞いた日南沢が水没するとかいう大事件だったんですよねダムについては多分ここの人に聞いた方が詳しいと思うけどなま僕が知っている範囲でいいんなら新聞で読んだ程度だけどねトムタカさんの愛を知っている範囲で見つけたら見つけたら見つけた Okay, so it's more recent than I thought it was. I thought the thing was saying, like, it's not going to be there,、um, but like 80 something. And again, men, no, like 75 or something. And I guess then it isn't actually that long ago in their time. Kurobe ni tsugu, kyodai na keikaku datta to kiite ne. There were three major issues in Japan at that time improving inter island transportation infrastructure, meeting the higher demand for electricity, and flood control. There was a boom of dam building due to the massive economic stimulus they provided on top of generating electricity and flood control. Hinamazawa had the right conditions to support dam construction, so it was singled out. Dam no kansei ni tomonatte umarelu dam ko wa. かなりの面積になったらしいねこの南沢からずっと上流の矢後地あたりまでが全部沈むことになったらしいしかし何だって人が住んでる南沢にわざわざダムを作るんですかもっと他の人が住んでないところに作ればいいのにジョグフィー doesn't work that way うーんよくは知らないんだがダムを作るのに適した地形ってのがあったって聞いてるねでも、そのプロセスは、この辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの辺りの The feeling of solidarity found here, which could not be expressed properly with mere words, was likely brought about by that battle. で、いろいろな不祥事や汚職が発覚してね。ややこしいことになっているうちに、工事中止が決まったんだそうだよ。If I wanted to know, now was my only chance to ask about the murder. It was certainly a bizarre incident that boys my age would be curious about. I felt a little shame from the fact that I was petty enough to have my curiosity piqued by Reno and Mion's refusal to talk about the event. But I figured I might as well ask since I had the chance. You can go over to the other person there? You as a resident? Just so I would stop thinking about it too, so much. I know. バラバラ殺人ってありましたよねあったよ偶然その時期に雛見沢にいてねだからよく覚えてるよ、mm-hmm. ちょうど4年前の今頃だったかなあれも確か綿流しの日だったね、oh, okay. 
Based on whether to continue the construction of the dam was in disarray. Scandal after scandal rocked the project near the end. The incident that was the final nail on the coffin for the dam project. That dam project, which would have sunk. Uh, more puns, sorry. A fight at the dam construction site ended in the victim being murdered. Fearing prosecution, the six assailants divided the remains into six pieces, and each hid one. Five of the six t criminals turned themselves in out of guilt, but one was still on the run. The right arm he'd hidden had yet to be found, but in four years, probably unrecognizable. Probably. Major details lined up with what was in the tabloid I'd read earlier. It certainly was a tragic incident, but it wasn't so terrible that Renner and Mion needed to hide it from me. I guess I didn't want someone who'd just moved here to have a negative impression of Hina Mizawa. I felt grateful for having friends who worried so much about me, as well as shame for being so interested for still being so interested in it. Oh, I don't know what to do with the trouble. Oyashiro-sama was the name of the god of the shrine that held the festival today, if I recalled correctly. I see. The guardian deity rained divine punishment down on the evil dam construction for trying to flood in his hour. I mean, if it's dam construction, then of course it's evil. More puns, sorry. It's just so easy to make a pun of it. You look really evil there. Like, really evil. I don't like your smile there. And this whole atmosphere. And that laugh. You're creepy. I don't like you. The woman with Tomitaka-san chuckled mischievously. Tomitaka-san began laughing with her. It was so infectious I ended up laughing as well. Was it you? Irute. The woman's lips were still curled into a smile, but her expression turned stern. Some more? Every year it happens. What continued every year? What continued every year? What happens? What? Tomitaka san paused for a second as if to build up some suspense. Then he whispered to me, as if someone might have been listening. Okay! <laughs> so, before we die, I'm going to end here for today. Uh, yeah. Let me know any feedback you had in the comments, and I'll see you next time. Till then, see ya.